Hey you guys, how's it going? Boss here, and today we are playing some Star Wars Force Arena. Now, uh, as you all know, update has come out and uh, a lot of good stuff, a lot of interesting stuff uh, that has popped up. Starting off with the unit. Let's yeah, let's talk about the units. That's not where I can find my units. Let's talk about the units. So, first one of our units here is a separatist assassin droid aka assassin spider droid uh, pretty badass as far as I've known in uh those uh pro killer swarm are really interesting they're super weak and they're not meant to take anything down but <laughs> I'm telling you guys you get one of these um, assassin droids out there, and they can do really good stuff. Now, mine's at level 8, and it's sitting at 1,865 health. Now, that gets extended, if you think about it, with the uh, swarm, due to the fact that it's another hit that they got a, you know, another object for them to hit, and takes a you know takes away some of the aggro from the actual assassin droid itself which in turn spawns more in um four seconds to deploy another wave of, of the uh pro killers now that's very good if you set one of these guys in the back of the map let them move forward there will be at least two to almost three uh swarms of these killer probes um, which is very helpful and uh, I, I do see this card being nerfed later down the road because right now I've been using it with Tarkin in this very very juicy deck that I'm running it's very AOE um, how, how do I say it AOE uh, deck you know got the TIE Fighter got the Sand Trooper and you know bringing in the uh, energy net and the nerve gas which you know help me slow down the enemy and allow me to push uh, pretty damn good and being for energy I'm able to spawn at least two at once I, I, there's, I even had a match where I had three of these guys out at once causing havoc on the map now if you see here my last few matches here with this Tarkin deck have been amazing. Have been very good and uh, very positive deck here. I love playing with it. It's very fun. But I do see these guys being nerfed later down the road. Uh, so we'll see what happens. And the uh, next card we're going to talk about. You know what? Actually, yeah, you know what? Let's do this real quick. Let's let's play this little the video here. So uh, here's the normal attack. As you see, there's those little probe droids. See, they take one, I mean, you know, they take a hit, but it's still a hit, which causes the opponent, well, or whatever card is attacking, to uh, get slowed down, as you can tell. That was an interesting video. I think that might be the first one you ever see <laughs> of the card actually getting destroyed. Interesting. Now, one card that everyone's been asking for was the B2 Super Battle Droids. Now they're finally out and they're pretty damn awesome. Though I think 5 energy might be a little bit too much, but they're pretty badass and they do in you know an amazing amount of damage. Now, you may be thinking, "Oh, well, 5 energy and it's only 948 health." Interesting, not too tanky. Well, you're right, not too tanky, but they deal really good attack power, and it's not just one, it's actually two. So if you think about it, you can kind of double the uh, health, really, uh, since it's two. And, uh, you know, once one of them goes down, the health and attack power do half. But, like I said, maybe this will get a buff later down the road, uh, as I see it for myself. Uh, but really could really cool to have in your decks and um to be able to use mines right now are sitting at a level eight so i haven't been using them too much 
Now, let's go over to the uh, Republic side of things. Now, I'm glad to have more uh, troopers to put in my decks. Uh, so, let's start off with the common uh, Arc Trooper. Now, he's pretty badass. Now, as it says in the description, he has um, you know, pretty low health. So, he's able to get taken down pretty easily. But if you put something in front of him... To keep him away, he's able to uh, deal some very good damage, as you can tell. And let's see, uh, health wise is good. DPS to structures is very good. Health very low, but he's a very uh, DPS uh, car um, card here, so he's able to do very good amounts of damage. And our next homie is our clone sharpshooter now he does work like any other sniper that you'll get on either side but an added bonus he has a possibility to uh penetrate from you know am i right penetrate where did i read that yeah yep his blaster has the ability to penetrate the enemy which is good that means he can deal damage from a distance and if there's another enemy right behind that one it'll take damage as well now as you can tell Health on these guys are always low, so they're always able to get taken down quickly. But they deal a lot of damage to squad and leaders, which is very, very good. And uh, so yeah, this is basically uh, the new cards out there. Uh, I would say they're pretty uh, unique uh, in a way. I would say the dark side got the more unique cards here. Um, there's not much unique stuff you can probably do with a uh, clone trooper as far as I don't know having a clone trooper spawn things. I mean unless you have like a Captain, but I mean I would like to see that as like a unique card later down the road. Maybe I don't know Cody as a unique that's able to spawn troops or something like that. That would be pretty awesome You know he follows he would follow uh, General Kenobi and maybe he'll snipe and be able to spawn troops. Man, that would be sounds pretty awesome. But that would be a talk for another day. Now another update uh, added is this new tab down here called Pick. Now we are gonna watch a match on this Pick uh, event here. So essentially, uh, I'm gonna go. Let's go with the side event, which you'll get an epic. Now. It shows you a bar of who chose who more. Uh, here, apparently, people will expect General Grievous to be able to kick ass. But um, I'm going to have to go with my girl Sabine over here. And uh, so what you're essentially doing here is you're giving up a epic card or whatever card select they want you to do. Um, so choose wisely. Um, I would choose things like, I don't know. The Zobrak Assassins. I don't really use them as much. Not saying that they're bad. Just saying it's not a card I would prefer to use for my playstyle. So I would uh, go ahead and uh, give one of those up. So now I'm expecting Sabine to be the winner. But we're not going to watch that match. It's in five minutes. What we're actually going to watch is this Darth Vader and Yoda match. Now this is a match. I think it's going to be worth watching. It's going to be pretty interesting. And with this one, my reward will be a legendary. So if I get lucky enough, I will get a legendary card out of, you know, we got um, Cassian, we got Hera, we got our homie, Ezra, Darth Vader, or Bosk. <laughs> but let's go ahead and view the results. Let's see who wins. I picked Yoda, as you guys can tell, because Yoda's pretty damn badass and he's a little broken right now, but I'm pretty sure later down the road, they'll patch him up and make him a little bit more balanced. And the reason why I say he's a little uh, overpowered right now is the fact that he can dodge a lot of hits. And I mean a lot of hits. So here we go. This guy started off, whew, oh man, he's throwing a lot of things down at once. Ooh, he did not place it correctly. I think he pushed too fast. Come on, Yoda, make me proud. Hopefully you guys can hear me. I know the game is about to get really loud. 
Uh, I'm about to just drop the value down just a little bit. It's a pretty decent push here. From Darth Vader. Let's get a better angle of the battlefield. I, I, I didn't notice that this was something they added. Now, I don't know if you can actually play the game like this. But this is something uh, pretty interesting. Oh man, you're just crazy. You're just crazy. <laughs> now he's got a tad push here. But that tank ain't gonna last. One hit took him out. Alright. Well, he's not pushing. That's interesting. Oh man, Yoda. Take out those snipers. Level 1 snipers though. Why is he letting himself get hit? Alright, so he's gonna take this tower, that's for sure. Yep, tower down. Now, if I were him, I would. Never mind. I would have pushed on the left lane, because that. This tower right here looks like it's gonna. Not gonna last. Come on, drop that. Commando. Come on, what are you doing? Why didn't you drop that commando? Oh man. He was saving his energy for Mace Windu. That could have cost him the game. That could have really cost him the game. So let's see. Let's see. I mean, I voted for Yoda, but he's going to let me down. That ain't going to be too good. Oh man, he's got the snipers right there. He's about to get destroyed. I have a little good push here. Let's see what Darth Vader is going to do. This is not looking good for Yoda. Oh man. You better have a good push. You got 30 seconds left. Good. You should have taken the aggro. You should have taken the aggro from that turret. You should have never let his units take uh, aggro. Now he's going to try to push... Oh wait, can he get it? Yes, he did actually get it. Now, this is getting very, very interesting. Alright, he has Mace Windu down. Ooh, Mace Windu's gonna make this uh, turret look bad. No, oh, that damage is insane. Oh my goodness. Wow, that damage. Once Wookiee Warrior and the Republic Commando got there, it was over. All right, now, now it's time to see what we win. Now, guys, you do not get to pick the card you get. It's randomly selected from what I showed you we could get. Now, if I would have lost, they would have given me 5,000 credits. But we got Bosk. One more to get the three. Awesome. All right, and uh, I'm pretty, I'm pretty happy to see the uh, merchant back. It's pretty badass looking. <laughs> He's always just staying there, looking pretty badass. So let's see. Here's another one, but this one's for a unique. Huh. I'll save this for next time. But shall we do a match? Okay. Let's see what Anne is talking about here. She's got 15 straight wins. Let's, you know what, hold up, what am I doing? Let's see if she can fight face me. Uh, let's try out, let's try out the light side. I have not been playing with light side so far. I've been playing that targeting deck with that new uh, new stuff. Let's see if we can get somebody in. Who's, who's online right now? All right, we got Swiss Cheese, we got AJ, and we got A-Bells. All right, let's see. They don't, they don't know I'm recording, so right, let's see what happens here. Oh, and one thing I forgot to get. To get your reward, you got to go into your inbox. So, don't forget to collect those. Don't let them sit there. Oh, man. Let's see if Anne joins. Come on. She could beat me because this deck I haven't really been using it. I just threw it together just to play with. Okay, she's joining. Is she is she gonna use? Oh no, who's she gonna use? Oh 
or maybe she's setting up a deck to face me. Oh, okay. This is going to be fun. And uh, sorry I haven't posted a video yesterday, guys. Um, for you guys to know, I'm working two jobs now. But uh, that's that's not going to stop me. It's not going to stop me. Still been playing this game. Still been enjoying it. And for you Titanfall Assault players, I will have another video up very shortly. So don't worry. Let's see how this goes. This could be bad. But uh, we're just here to have fun and experiment with these new guys. Alright, she dropped those units there. Ooh, okay. I'm gonna try to grab their aggro here. Alright, so they're in a line and now they're taking fire. Now it looks like once the hit goes through, it won't be as much. Alright, let me drop these guys here. Give them a little boost. Alright, come on, let's deal some damage. Alright, I don't wanna jump her yet. Alright, now I wanna drop her. Stun her there. Alright, melted, melted. Let's get Oh no! Oh no. Alright, wasn't able to give a good push. We did some good damage though. I think I got a little too crazy with the energy. But we're good. Alright, dropping that right there. Should be able to do some good damage on these guys. Alright. I should oh no sniper went down that's down all right she's holding my my troops I actually like actually like that I'm actually pretty happy <laughs> she she held out my troops all right now we get to push a little bit oh I said Ashoka go Ashoka go Ashoka what's going on oh game what's going on? what what confused I am why she wait what <laughs> I don't know what just happened I'm glad I, I caught that on the camera oh my god what was that that was weird I'm right, gonna try to push here but I'm not gonna allow her Just let me get oof oof man penalized are really good for that one all right, these guys are going to get melted really quick. All right, she has 35 seconds. She's got to figure something out. Oh, man. What is up with his lag? Is it... If I get kicked out, I'll be so sad. Taking a lot of hits. I can't move. I really... Guys, I really could not move. I was tapping the screen, and I could not move. All right, she's coming back. All right, good, good, good. And we would have gotten that tower. <laughs> All right, that was really good and really random lag. And I know my connection should be good. That was kind of weird. Um, all right, that was definitely a good game. And I know you're going to watch this video, so really good match. Um, uh, what was I going to say? Uh, and if you, I know you're watching this, try to split push, try to make me move to one side while you push to the other, uh, like I was doing to you. So definitely something you can uh, definitely try to do whenever you get play again. Um, but already, so I'm gonna show you guys before I leave, before I end the video, a pre-recorded, I mean, well, a highlight of one of my videos. Here, um, let's see, we got, let's just watch the first one right there against the Anakin. Now, this was definitely a good match. Uh, definitely held him back really good with those assassin droid. Alright, so, you know what, we might just time to fast forward this, get that good angle here. So we can just see the battlefield a little better. All right, I love this angle though, man. I, hope, I haven't tried seeing if I can play like this, but 
really loving this angle. All right, so I'm really saving my energy here. And uh, that would look like I would have failed in that. <laughs> but definitely got him to push back. He pushed back and I had, I see I have him on both angles. He was having such a hard time. And uh, <laughs> oh man, I ran away from him. I got pretty lucky there, but did some good damage on both his towers. One's about to go out, and so I'm not really too worried about that. TIE Fighter can take it down. So we already go. Drop that in the way. Get rid of those guys. Really making him work here. So I'm waiting for my Spider Droid. Boom, drop my Spider Droid right where she dropped her Ashoka. That was just fine. And bam. Got my money's worth right there with that TIE Fighter. He's trying to take down this. Oh, uh, there's my Spider Droid going. Look at all those. Oh my god, the the pro spiders, man. Look at them. They don't do, like, as, as you can see, they get taken down very quickly, but they did so good. Yeah, and I'm able to get so many out. You know, uh, uh, a good amount of spider droids. Like I said, two to three spider droids out at, at a time, depending on how I use it. And uh, that was a pretty, you know, fast forward match, but uh, that's basically how we've been using that targeting deck. Now, this deck, I gotta give props to Quias. He uh, basically told me about the idea of it. His deck is a little bit different. He has the uh, Bladesman and the Bladesman and Tie Bomber. When, but I run the uh, Sand Trooper and Tie Fighter. Um, I it's, this has been working better for me, but his deck has been working good for him. Not everyone plays the same. Uh, Quiet, so I loved your deck. It's really good, and um, it's amazing. And I have to give him like a big props for that. But alrighty, guys, I'm gonna head out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, little uh, run through. There's more stuff I probably didn't get to uh, talk about in this video, but this was the overall of uh, the latest update, and um, really happy with them right now. Uh, the only thing is, they need to. Uh, definitely check is our um, connections one thing I definitely hope they can fix because right now uh, I want to start a tournament on my outer galactic guild but unfortunately I can't due to the fact that not every player can play with each other in the friendly battles so uh, if net marble catches this video man please help us out uh, check that uh, networking I'm not sure what's going on just can't connect to people uh at times to do a tournament so i really want to do a tournament for my guild and they've been waiting for one and they want one so i want to give them one Alrighty, guys this is going to be the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed it enough to leave a like and if you really enjoy these videos don't forget to subscribe i put up gameplay videos like this and many more every single day and as always peace